Doctor. It looks like the monthly subscription crate business is uh, kind of uh, found me and they're they're taking over me because I just got this box in the mail today uh, from Japan Crate. So this is um well obviously it's a bunch of stuff from Japan. It's called Doki Doki. As you can see right there. So isn't that <laughs> something awesome? So I wanted to say that if you want to sign up for this box, that there is a coupon that you can use, which is in the description of this video. Uh, I submitted the coupon code to be Zippy, um, so hopefully that's what it is, and so hopefully that'll give you a little discount for getting this sort of thing. So if you like things from Japan, and I'm sure most of you do since you're Pokemon fans or Splatoon fans, then this is probably the thing for you. Let's go ahead and get this open and, and see what's inside. And I just realized I don't have a utility knife with me, so uh, this should be fun. Okay, I finally got it open. Let's go ahead and tear it off and oh, already we can see some awesome things here. Look at that, the inside of the box has this awesome print on it. Oh, I love the designs of everything, oh man. Japan really always goes above and beyond. And it says here on the side of the box, experience Japan through everything kawaii. Or kwei. I'm sorry, I, I never really did figure out how to pronounce that. So it looks like this is the August issue and we've got this little booklet here it reads right to left just like things do in Japan we got awesome art all over the place let's go ahead and open it up and read it uh, August's theme uh, is back to school that's awesome so it looks like this comes with a little comic book there that looks awesome uh, it comes with all sorts of um, information about what's in this back-to-school crate. We've got all sorts of things that you can expect in future ones, all sorts of things that are in Japan. Uh, we've got a contest here in the back that you can enter, and then it shows who won last month's contest, all sorts of things here in this little booklet, um, which if you want to read everything, then you're going to have to go ahead and get one of these yourself. And okay, we've got all sorts of things in here. Where to start? Um, I guess we can start with these. Hold on. It should say in here what all this stuff is, so I, I don't ruin it, uh, what it is. Okay, so we got, um, this, which is a pass holder. So this is a homeroom bear, as you can see right there, it says homeroom bear. So it, it's just a little plushie that kind of fits on your keychain. Oh, this is retractable too. I can let go and it goes back in, kind of like Woody's pull string. Uh, and then on the back, you can have your ID, your driver's license, your passport, anything really, or your school ID, I think is what it's most useful for. So you just put this on your backpack and if you need your ID for something, you just reach behind you, pull it up and show your ID and then let it go and it goes back to his place. That's pretty awesome. And it looks awesome too. It looks like Winnie the Pooh with glasses, I think. So, okay, now what else do we have here? We have, um, we got tape here. <laughs> Not sure exactly how to describe this. Um, this is called washi tape. As you can see there, it, got, it has all sorts of different designs and we got five different holes all together. And the description of this says, um, washi tape is super versatile and can be used for decorating, organizing, or do-it-yourself crafts. This month we have super kawaii washi tape featuring Hop, Chan, and friends. Visit our blog at blog.japancrate.com for some ideas on how to use it. So this is craft tape. Okay, this is pretty awesome. So if you have some sort of craft that you need some sort of pretty tape to wrap everything up in, then you just use this. I can see this being used for toilet paper rolls. Is it sad that that's the first thing I came up with? The first thing I thought of? I have ideas for this. We have, looks like, charms here. Look at all of these different charm designs. Sorry about the glare, if the glare is there. I think I got it pretty well. Look at all these different charms. Uh, looks like this is based off of Let It Lappin, Letit Lappin, or whatever. Uh, Petit Lappin is a Japanese bunny who loves French culture and resembles a macaron when he wears a barrette. He was the first Doki Doki exclusive plushie in Maze Crate. Now he's returned as a cute and squishy charm. Look at these. Just look at these. Actually, wait, no, I, I don't know what those were, but this is is the silicone charm. Look at that. 
look at that. Yeah, this is what it was. This is Petit Lapin. So, this is awesome. Thinks he's French, apparently. <laughs> uh, this is cool. And if any of you can read Japanese, then this is what it says on the bottom. I can't read Japanese that well, so I'll leave that up to you. Okay, we have a notebook here. Uh, Sumiko Garashi notebook. Notebooks are a must-have item at school, so we've included a Sumiko Garashi one this month. The shy characters mostly feel comfortable while hiding in corners, but will keep you company as you study. So, this is a, a well, it's a notebook. And then on the inside, we have, on, on the bottom of each page, we've got the group there at the bottom. On the bottom right corner, then over here we have uh, the group in uh, uh, a much smaller uh, variant. And then on the back, we've got them all over again in black and white. So this is a really cool notebook. This actually has a whole lot of use for me since I like keeping notes and stuff about future videos I need to make. We have a little pencil case here, a uh, Hop Chan pencil case. So this is awesome. This is what you can keep your pencils in, obviously. So if you are in school, this is basically the perfect loot crate for you. Holy cow. Or, or I'm sorry, Japan crate. Notice how you can never find a pen when you need one? Not to worry, this canvas pencil case will hold all your pens and pencils together. You can also use it to store loose items like chapstick and keys so you don't have to rummage through your bag. Convenient. Well, this isn't really the pencil case for me since um, I'm a guy, but it, this is pretty awesome, actually. So, man, this is really, really cute, too. And it just looks so cool. It looks like one of those things that you might have made in school um, using um, uh, stitch it by number. I don't know what you call it these days, but you would basically sew uh, following a path and it would come out to look like a picture. Kind of like uh, color by number, but yeah. Except it's a bag. We have two things left. We have chocolate dipped biscuit pens. When you can't snack during class, you can keep something sweet with you while you study. These pens look like yummy chocolate covered biscuits and each crate comes with one of five different flavors. Ooh. So this is a pen that looks like chocolate. For a second I thought it was actual chocolate, but I guess that's a little hard to ship, isn't it? So this, uh, I'm guessing this is the, I, I don't know what flavor this is. Hold on. Is this actual? <laughs> Let me open this up and see what it is. Okay, it is an actual pen. Oh, uh, it's red on the inside, so I guess this is uh, the strawberry um, flavor uh, of, of the pen. Just look at the design on this. <laughs> you see how it looks chocolatey? This looks like it could be like a chocolate biscuit. Now I'm hungry for a real chocolate biscuit, but they don't have those over here. And then finally we have uh, the, the thing that I think I'm most excited for because I can actually make great use of this. We have a shirt. Look at, this is a big shirt, wow. Look at this, um, there went the box. <laughs> Just go ahead and look at this, huh? That looks awesome. Holy cow. So I can't read Japanese, so I, I can't see what it says, but it looks awesome, I'll give it that. Let me go ahead and find that booklet again so I can see what it, this is. Rilla Kuma t-shirt, dazzle your classmates on the first day of school with this Rilla Kuma t-shirt. Each shirt comes in a lovely dusty pink color. And features a cute print of Coraluka, uh, uh, Cor, Cor, Coralakuma giving Rilakuma a relaxing massage. What accessories will you wear with your shirt? So, this is definitely something I could wear. <laughs> Man, I love, this is pretty big though, but that's not a problem. So, that's pretty awesome. Love the shirt, I love the ID badge, I love I love everything in this crate. So, like I said, if you want stuff like this in the future, then be sure to sign up for Japan Crate. A link to it is in the description. Remember, you can use the coupon code ZIPPY to get a special discount on it. So, that pretty much does it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed, and be sure to let me know if you want to see future crate unboxings in the future. 
Thanks everyone for watching and stay tuned for more.